in the southern section, just on goal difference at the moment. Wolves come into tonight's final on the back out over Manchester City by two goals to one, the reigning academy champions. Luke Rawlings, Wesley Okadua and Fraser Harper are recalled. As for Chelsea, Wolves at Molyneux. It will be Chelsea to get us underway, attacking the goal away to our right. Interesting to see Frankie Runham on this right-hand side, almost with the boots on the touchline straight away. He's had such a good season through as group winners. Seven group winners plus the best runner-up went through to the knockout stages. Stoke City were the best runner-up. They didn't lose a fixture, but they ran into Wolves in the semi-finals, that was after Wolves got 3-1 success and then that win over Stoke 2-1 G with the Chelsea Runham standing over this, Harrison as well, it will be Harrison to curl towards the back post, awkward header just unable to keep it down out swinger towards the far post for Chelsea and indeed Wolves for that matter in the northern section to maybe make it through to European competition. This is the under 17 age group, so it's slightly different. The UEFA Youth League under 19s. Been a little nervy maybe in the opening exchanges. Chelsea with a flurry of set pieces here. Cardoso's touch. Ronan will play it inside the penalty area. Plenty of blue shirts around. It was Manalo that tried. Taken short. Ronan, it's a good block. Patterson looks to play it forward, stopped in his track by Wheeler Henry. Flick back towards Patterson once again. An opportunity now for Wolves to come forward. Clever ball inside the. Angel has made the move through the centre. Back towards Patterson on this left hand side. <coughs> Academy League, Bradbury to kill this one in potentially. Let's see. Driven in towards the far post, the header is over. And on goal, but we've talked about his goal scoring prowess already. Sing initially from Makaidu, cleared away by Benjamin. Patterson's touch is good, and there's a break on here. This is McLeod, he's got Angel to his right. It's a good looking ball. The finish, though, he's nowhere near the target. Finished in a goal, that's a clever ball from Patterson. McLeod got forward, and Angel to his right here. Maybe just run him. Cardoso. Oh, that's a good ball. Chelsea coming forward now. Run has moved to that central position. Blue still on the attack here. It's through towards Frankie. Run him. Position. But that's a fine start from Benjamin, who came out to the edge of his six yard box here to. Driven to the edge of the area. And this is Run didn't quite get hold of it as he wanted to. It's all a bit awkward inside the penalty area. Wolves just about clear. And tweet. Another good looking run. Chelsea come forward at pace and in numbers. Twist and a turn inside the penalty area. Still they come and that's a decent effort. That's the ball come across his body. This is Runham, fast feet to move away from the first challenge of Patterson and then a really good ball to the left-hand side. Gabo will take it down, Antwi on his outside. Makaidu calling for it as well. Antwi with a good-looking ball in, doesn't beat the first man. It's good defensive work. And a good view for Antwi. And come on. And still... Kaido waits inside the penalty area. Here's the cross forthcoming. Bo will go for the shot, but gets underneath it. What he made to him straight from the keeper. Angles it off really nicely. Chelsea coming forward with real purpose here. Antwi with a terrific run. Great balance and composure. But the shot again. Antwi with a mazy run here, showing really good pace and balance. Gets it onto his left side. Run him. Gets his pocket pick there. This is Caden Boyce coming forward. It's a strong run as well. McLeod will get the cross in. And it will try and get Wolves players to 
put pressure on further and further towards your own penalty area. And then you try and break through the press, but don't give it away. This is McLeod with the shot. Got to play through it, not give it away. An awful lot of first teams play, of course, in the Premier League. It is not easy. And at academy level, you are going to make mistakes. Just the nature of young players. Look at who are coming forwards here for Wolves. It's towards Danny Angel, cleared away by Wheeler Henry. And Crampton had spotted the danger and comes outside of his penalty area. It's really good goalkeeping. Good ball. Still, come on. And still he goes. Mo's efforts. Oh, what a goal! Rio Ngmo with a terrific strike as Chelsea have the advantage. Also, of the half, his influence on the game has grown. And Rio Ngmo unleashes a shot from 25 yards or so. Ngamoa right on the stroke of half time. Half time beckon, but they are in a strong position, leading by a goal to nil as this second half starts. Antwi under pressure. Might need a little bit of help here. Tries to clear but loses out. Harper will look to come on, takes a wicked deflection and goes in. Harper will claim it, but that ricocheted around. But Chelsea were trying to clear. Harper picked it up. Just look at this. One, two deflections and then in. Then it seems to hit Subaloy. Then it ricochets beyond the keeper. Crampton's got no chance. He's trying to sell him the opening two minutes of this second period. Harper will claim the goal. Look on you for Antwi. Inside the area, still going forward. Chelsea's goal scorer. Cross needed to be flighted towards the back post. So a reset. Oh, given away. Runham could be in here for Chelsea. Still going. Oh, yes. That will do nicely. Poor defending from the hosts. And they have been punished. And how. Really well taken here from Frankie Runham. Had a strong start to the first half. And in this second, this is sloppy from Wolves. But there's good pressure on the ball. And then a couple of touches, makes space on his right foot. And that's a terrific hit to beat Benjamin in the wall. He has had such a good competition, Frankie Runham. One of the stars of the run to the final, fitting that he's got down. Hayden Voice to try and clear and does. Haven't seen too much of McLeod thus far, but he's broken free here. Danny Angel calling for it. Angel can't make it. Back over here towards Fabian Reynolds. Reynolds, a twist and a turn. It's on his left side. And the header towards goal is collected by... It's the header that was awkward, wasn't it, really, from McLeod. Alagundu. And Tweet. Pace to keep it in play and race free. Antwi with a really good run here. Looks to try and squeeze it into the near post. There were runners. He looks a terrific player. He's got great balance. See what he was trying to do in fairness. Oh, that's a clever touch. And Angel could be in. Still Danny Angel. Slip at the back. Danny Angel with a curl up. And Patterson was joining in. Wonderful touch round the corner here. Initially from Fabian Reynolds. And Danny Angel. Well, all two goals to one. Kadawu. Patterson on the move. We've seen as much of him getting forward in advanced positions in this second half, but we certainly have. 
when it comes to Reynolds, whose shot is cleared away. Not quite a really good defensive header. This was flying towards goal. Did it have that little bit of... Alagunju. Harrison threads it through. Terrific play. And suddenly Ngamoa's on his way once again. Still Ngamoa. Good work over on the right-hand side here. And he's towards Ronan once more. Inside the penalty area. And the shot is wide. From Washington. Prodded forward by Harrison. Wade. Harrison again. Flag has stayed down here. And Mayuka will move through the gears. It's still Shimi Mayuka. It's a really powerful run. Exactly where the ball was going. Wolves, though, have it again. G with a layoff. McLeod. And still, it's a fair hit. Straight down. The Henry wins it back fairly. Run him in fields. Barber to take it. Threads it through. And Mayuka could be in here. And it's still Shimi Mayuka. And still the angle's getting tighter. Keep a defender post onside definitely. Credit the way that Carson got back here. Just put the doubt in Mayuka's mind. And in the end the keeper got some. And it comes towards Olegunju. And then Frankie Ronham. Oh, yes! Sweetly struck by Chelsea's number seven. Wonderful goal. Three minutes to go to surely rubber stamp victory in the under 17 Premier League Cup final against Wolves. Look at this for technique. But surely, with just two minutes remaining and added on time, Chelsea. Angel to back in. He tries to curl inside the area and eventually the shot from the substitute. Whipped in towards the near post, flicked away. Washington doing the job. You can see it. Wolves looking for a second. Runham has it. And looks to curl it forward for Wade, who's on the move here. He's chasing it down. Mooka to his right. Might want to go himself. Does go himself. Can't find the target. Inside his own half. Racing free. Mooka to his right. He glanced across. Wanted to go himself. Did everything right. I'm alone. Wade had that chance just a few moments ago. That is full time. And that is the trophy. Chelsea, 23-24 winners of the under-17 Premier League Cup. And it's a thoroughly deserved success from the Blues as well. Frankie Runham will get the headlines, but it's a terrific team performance. Gamoa's goal just before half-time made it 1-0. Wolves hit back into the second half with Harper's deflected effort. But Runham with two brilliantly taken goals have given Chelsea a 3-1 success in the final. And the Premier League Under-17 Cup goes to the Blues.